Hello everyone, you are watching the M2B Gamer and we are doing a commentary on Fire Range, Search and Destroy. And I've got a few things to talk about today. I'm uh, well give me a chance because this is actually the first ever commentary, full game commentary I've ever done. And I actually have things to talk about instead of like stuttering and shit. But uh, I've recently just watched a video of the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 trailer and it's it it's alright, it, it looks good. I'll leave the link in the description so you can check it out. But it's like the Modern Warfare 2 when they released the trailer. It's just the sound waves like it just shows the sound waves or whatever you call it. It's no like proper gameplay. And there's some people talking in the background, that's all. Um I've been researching a lot on Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 and I've had the uh, they are actually putting vehicles in, back into the game like COD 5 and Personally, to me, COD 5 with vehicles, it's it's like, um, what's the word, it's just annoying, like everyone says, Call of Duty is basically a running gun game, if you ask me, they should put vehicles in Call of Duty, because it's basically juggernaut, because it's just going to get annoying after a while, you're going to be running around, trying to get your kills, and then there's someone in a tank who's just going to ride up to you and just shoot you in the face. With the, with the fucking rocket, so yeah. <sighs> so I got a black nose, I, I feel ill. But I know. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, tell me what you think in the comments. Um, should there be vehicles? Shouldn't there be? Um, there, there is actually pictures of the game, the game maps and stuff, and a bit of gameplay. There is actually pictures released I've seen on YouTube. Um, so you go check them out. If I can, I'll put the link in the description for that as well. But. Uh, like I said, vehicles for Modern Warfare 3, I don't think it would go. I think it would be very annoying and most probably a lot of people will end up getting mad at the game and selling it. Because we all experienced the vehicles in COD 5. Well, not all, you know, whoever actually bought the game. But if you play COD 5, there you have tanks on Team Deathmatch and stuff. If you like vehicles, then go on. Good news for you, you got vehicles on Modern Warfare 3. But if you dislike them, then this is like keeping you up to date this i'm telling you what's going to happen but it's like i've said the only information i don't know if the information is true or false but it's the same goes for the video if you don't know if the model for three trailers real or fake um because like, someone can easily create a model for three trailer and just get you viral on that but at the moment the model for three trailer looks actually quite real i, I can't believe it is real um <laughs> But we'll have to see when it comes out. Um, I, I don't know when about whereabouts it's going to be released. When about? Uh, um, I think it's November. I'm not sure. That's what everyone's telling me. But I, I don't know. Well, we'll have to find out. But yeah, that's basically what I had planned talking about. And at the moment, I've got nothing to talk about. <laughs> yeah. Um, Man of War Three. Um, everyone. Is gonna get out of this big hype up like they had for Call of Duty Black Ops, because most people got the hype up for Call of Duty Black Ops, and then once it was released and you actually played the game, a lot of people like disliked the game, and God knows how many people actually sold it. Because they tell you how many people actually bought the game, like oh my God, um, Call of Duty Black Ops sells three billion copies. They actually don't tell you how many people sell <laughs> sold it back or gave it back. <laughs> Uh, th that's what does my head because you know, yeah, you, you sell a lot of copies of Call of Duty, but there is also going to be a lot of copies going back because so many people get that uh, pissed off the game. But like I said, Modern Warfare 3, there is going to be a big hype about it. I don't know if everyone will actually like it, like Modern Warfare 2 or COD 4. Personally, COD 4 is my favourite Call of Duty. My favourite Call of Duty is um, Call of Duty 5. I just like that game because you could like shoot someone with a shotgun and boom, the body parts go flying everywhere, and I just like it. But yeah, Modern Warfare 2 was a good game. I enjoyed that game. Um, Call of Duty Black Ops. I don't enjoy it as much as I enjoy Modern Warfare 2 or Call of Duty 5. I think um, they've like I don't know. Decreased the fun you have on playing Call of Duty because it's changed during the years. It wasn't so long ago; it just felt like I'm playing Call of Duty 3, you know, with the tanks and stuff. But 
Yeah, Call of Duty Black Ops. I like the game, but I don't think it's actually the best game. Call of Duty, well, out of the Call of Duty franchise. Uh, Modern Warfare 3, I'm looking forward to the game. Uh, I'm going to get it. Um, I think it is actually going to be worth buying that, because it, if, if they have quick scoping in it, because that's what everyone's asking, it, it, do they have quick scoping? Can you quick scope on it? Are they going to pass quick scoping? Personally, I don't think they will pass quick scoping because how many people got annoyed um, for Call of Duty Black Ops patching quick scoping? Um, then they had all these updates to make it better and stuff. And, but um, anyway, Modern Effect 3 comes out soon. The link is in the description. This match is ending. There's a the scoreboard. Hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Um, this was my first ever commentary for a game. Hope I've done well. If I haven't, then, you know, sorry. But please like, rate, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.